Mr. Azar, the CDC is saying that over the next year that m many Americans will be exposed to this virus and there's a good chance that they will become sick. So the, the, the chance of spread, it seems to be acknowledged, is going to be high. So when we talk about a low risk, that we're talking about that second type, I guess, seriousness of illness? So, so it's two issues. First, the risk of getting it for anyone right now. I said right now is low. Now that can change over time as this spreads further in the United States. We of course are doing aggressive containment and mitigation efforts at the local, state, and national level to prevent Mr. further Azar, spread or to mitigate parse, that spread. I'm sorry to parse the time frame here, but I think we want to be clear with Americans. They should prepare over the next year, right now or in the next 12 months, to be exposed and potentially become sick from this virus. Yes. We've been very clear from day one that we're going to see further spreading and we would see more cases. The most important issue right now for your viewers would be the elderly, especially the medically frail elderly, as well as any individual with certain medical fragility uh, issues like liver disease, kidney disease, diabetes, uh, recovering from cancer or immunosuppressed condition. These are the individuals globally that we've seen who tend to get the most severe consequences from getting the virus. Most of us, if we contract the virus get mild to moderate symptoms globally. All right, Secretary Azar, thank you very much.